What is a cursor? Well, let's say you perform a query on your table using Python slash MySQL. The system is going to execute that query and return to you a result set. Where are you going to put that result set? Well, in MySQL, we put that result set in a structure called the cursor. And this cursor has constraints imposed upon it. Well, first off, it's read-only. What does that mean? Well, the result set came from data in an underlying table. Well, guess what? You can't update that underlying table with your cursor. So what do we do then? You assign the cursor to a variable in Python, like m. m is the manager. It is the manager of the cursor. In Python, I might write into my code m equals con.cursor, open close parens. Variable m is now the manager of the cursor. I then tell manager m to fetch all the records out of the cursor and assign that to another variable, which I can now iterate through, work with, and update my underlying table with. And I think that's a good basic introduction to a cursor. For now. This is George Poole. If you enjoyed this video, please rate it by clicking on the like button. I would deeply appreciate that. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye now.